Hello, people. I'm Jabby Kuwait. This is my guest, Elizabeth Jane. We're gonna look at M Cream, the official trailer. It's already out in theaters, but let's check it out. <laughs> I know the world's a fucked up place, but I'm also smart enough to know that there's nothing that you or I, sitting here in this beautiful, posh farmhouse, can do about it. Do it, Nasa. We've been waiting for you for over an hour, Peter. Aapki dad bata rahe the ki aapko corporate job mein bahut interest hai. Mujhe to bas jealous se pyar. We're doing a case study on political refugees. the most different Indian trailer I've ever seen. What a first one for you to be. Holy Jesus. So that is definitely the first Indian film I've seen where it was such a strong emphasis on drugs and it said it right there that it was the first Indian stoner movie so that sets it apart dramatically. The thing is, I don't know if you can legitimately call this a stoner movie because it is on the dramatic side. Yeah. It's under the guise of being this comedy this kind of sex comedy, but it's not. It's got a serious undertone to it. You can see with some kind of, I don't know if it's a revolution or something happening, but I saw soldiers in there running around trying to break shit up. It's very reminiscent of things we experienced in the 70s, late 60s, 70s, that inspired a lot of the classic rock music that was very anti-war, anti-fighting, just, you know, peace, love, drugs, Woodstock type shit. That's what this movie is. That's the first of its kind. And so I am totally just, like... You're blown away. I'm, I'm... I mean, I would know. No. I mean, it's interesting. I feel like they revealed so much in the trailer. They, 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 you, like, you, you'll find that with a, a number of Indian trailers that it's either it's super <laughs> mysterious or it's super revealing. It is not a middle ground that I've found in a trailer quite yet. And huh. so... For someone like me, who's an ignorant foreigner to the films, it helps to see more. So I'm like, oh, okay, I see what's going on. I have a better idea. Because if they didn't reveal as much, I would have no <coughs> idea what this movie's about. It would just look like a, a douchey comedy. Yeah. You know? Well, it starts out that way, and then it's like suddenly they're in the mist, and it's serious. See, that's the that's the <laughs> that's the subtle trick about these Indian trailers is it starts out one way, which is good. It's almost like a mini story in itself. You're like, we've got you, and then yeah. by the way. <laughs> yeah, like if if anytime you see an Indian trailer where things are happy and peachy, you know it's gonna get super fucked up <laughs> by the end of the trailer. <laughs> so that's essentially what happened here. That Rastafari here. I, I, I cannot get behind yeah, that. Yeah, I was... No. Yuck. It's like, ugh. That... I feel like the, it, it's trying so hard to be obviously hippie-ish that like, they had they just like, went there. Like I said, like is, is like obvious 
that they did like a 70s themed intro like they're just playing to the like stereotypes mm -hmm. it is like they're like you said like one of the first films that like comes from there that's about yeah. weed and, and peace and it's 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 a funny thing because they're at a different point in their history so to speak than right. we are so we've experienced this already it's a, it, it's not a good or a bad thing it's just we experienced this already we experienced our drug our sex revolution, our free love revolution, we already went through all that. It seems like this film is representative of an idea that they're kind of going through that now. Because the film's unique, because it's different, I would check this out. It's got a lot of accolades, which is just... That was surprising to see just the rows and rows of accolades for the film. So, obviously this movie is not a stoner movie. I, 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 I find it a little bit disrespectful they're calling it a stoner <laughs> movie. Because a stoner movie is just a kind of a brainless comedy yeah. that is purely for shits and giggles. It's not meant to educate you, to open up your mind, to elucidate any ideas that are going on in a certain area of the world. It's just meant to be dumb fun, essentially. And they try to sell you on that, but then they sneak in that serious shit to let you know, oh, no, 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 what's more going on here? Mm, yeah. <laughs> it sells you at the stoner shit. Yeah, exactly. So anyways, you guys, uh, let us know in the comments what you think. Please follow Elizabeth Jane on the social media. Check out other reactions, reviews, short films, and video game related videos. I'm Jabby Kawai. This is Elizabeth Jane. Peace out.